memory back. Like sands through the hourglass, so are the days of our lives. Do I have feelings for Sierra? Why would you ask me that? Well... Because you two used to date, and from what you just said about her... I, I said I'm glad she's back. Theo, you said more than that. You know she's married, right? Of course I do. Okay, just checking. Look, oh, Sierra may have amnesia. But my memory is fine. And I just broke up with someone. And weirdly, she just showed up here in Salem. Wait, she, she followed you here? No, she said she came to visit her mother, who has family here. Wait, your ex-girlfriend's mother has family in Salem? Who is she? I have no idea. Stop doing that. Well, stop reaching for my food and I won't have to slap your hand away. I thought you were done freaking out over room service. No one's freaking out. Well, the table is set for two. <laughs> yes, and my dear, you are not one of those two. Mmm, someone's coming to our room for lunch. My room. And yes, I'm having an important business meeting, which means you need to make yourself scarce for the next couple of hours. And do what? This town isn't exactly bustling with excitement. Ooh, I'm so sorry that Salem doesn't live up to your entertainment standards, but I was thinking that maybe you could spend this valuable time looking for a job. How? Where? Well, just knock on some doors, see who's hiring. But I don't even know what I'm qualified to do. You're smart. I'm sure that you'll figure out a way to make a living now. Now, go on, go on. I don't want to see your behind back here until you can support yourself. want to take on Paulina's money. Yes, but for the kids' education. Eli, it's too much. Do you know how much college tuition is going to be in 18 years? Yeah, more than two cops can afford, which is why I think we should accept the gift. <sighs> I don't like taking handouts. Neither do I. But, Lonnie, we've been talking about saving money, and you and I both know we're not going to be able to save enough. We'll figure it out. How? By saddling ourselves and the kids with giant loans, not to mention giving up vacations, getting a bigger place, and a walk-in closet. You're not playing fair. Um, look, think of what the extra cash could free up. I mean, we could take the kids to Disneyland. They can go to camp, piano lessons. They were just born. What, are they not going to grow up? Hey, Pauline.